live images here. I think the mission has been achieved. Handing over to mission director. This is mission control, mission director. The LBM3 M4 Chandrayaan mission accomplished its precise satellite injection conditions. LBM3 M4 mission is successful. Jai Hind. The launch has also added a feather in the cap of LVM3 rocket. You can watch the jubilee and congratulatory gestures. The ovation has begun the standing ovation there at ISRO, much deserved. A billion people in the country standing with ISRO right now as they congratulate each other. A well-earned smile on every face there at the Satish Dhawan Space Centre as applause breaks out and the program director declares that the LVM-3 M4 Chandrayaan-3 mission, the first phase, has been declared a success. Everything has gone to plan. The 16 minutes are complete. All stage separations have been taken place on exactly the right path. And here you have the program director of Chandrayaan-3 there with Union Minister Jitendra Singh presenting him with a model and commemorating the successful launch. What an incredible achievement and a well-deserved moment, uh, you know, not only to smile but also to exhale. This is Indian rocket science, this is Indian engineering, this is Indian research, this is the, the absolute meticulousness of the Indian space program on full display here, viewer. Emotional scenes there at the Satish Dhawan Space Center, and India. all of these scientists also know. Let's listen. Chandrayaan 3 has started its journey towards Moon. Our dear LVM 3 has already put Chandrayaan 3 craft into the precise orbit around Earth. 170 by 36,500 kilometer was its intended target orbit, and it is precisely there now. And let us wish all the best for the Chandrayaan-3 craft to make its further orbit racing maneuvers and travel towards moon in the coming days. So let me wish all the very best to Chandrayaan-3 for its further journey towards moon. Before that, let me introduce the team behind uh, this mission, the mission director, Mr. Mohan Kumar, and also the, and also the project director of LVM-3. And uh, we have also the mission director for the Chandrayaan-3 craft, the project director of Chandrayaan-3, Veera Muthavel. So, over to them. Mohan. Thank you, sir. Honorable, Honorable Minister of State for Science and Technology and Departments of Space and Atomic Energy, uh, Dr. Jitendra Singh, respected uh, Chairman ISRO and Secretary of Department of Space, former secretaries of the department, invited dignitaries, respected uh, dignitaries and invitees. I am very happy to report here that the LVM-3 M4 vehicle has injected the Chandrayaan-3 satellite to the uh, precise orbit. Uh, and once again, the vehicle is proved to be the most reliable heavy lift vehicle of Indian Space Research Organization. Congratulations to the teamwork of ISRO family. Uh, I would like to appraise three things here. The vehicle systems are in the continuous process of quality improvement, especially in the, uh, in the uh, event of our human rating efforts towards making the systems reliable. Secondly, the payload also, capability of the payload also is improved by mission uh, strategies as well as vehicle engineering approaches. We are in the process of increasing the launch uh, frequency of this vehicle considering the national requirements as well as satellite demands. Here, so many uh, improvements we have uh, incorporated in this vehicle. For example, the S200 nozzle, they are processed exactly as per the human rating standards, uh, uh, enabling us to have 100% NDT and the inherent pocket erosion characteristics are removed. The L100 and stage Vikas engine Mostly it is 100% qualified to be the human rated engine with the indigenously developed LET throats and the pocket, uh, the uh, back wall gas entry also is eliminated and it is a perfect uh, system. Uh, and the C2D, C2D stage also is uh, 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 perfectly, uh, 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 actually, sorry. <laughs> 
So we will, uh, we will yeah. describe all those details later uh, because sir. of shortage of time. Yes, sir. I take this opportunity to thank all the mission executives uh, because <laughs>